Hi everybody, it's Esther. And Danielle. Sorry we're filming so late in the day. Gosh, our light's not going to be good, but I had to wait for Danielle to get home from work because I just wanted her to be here to show the final product. All right. This is the final installment of the Notebook series. Everybody clap. Yay! Okay. Obviously, you all saw this one. And you all saw this one. This is what I decided to do with this one. Uh, I used the black vinyl and cut that out on my Cricut in a fancy font. Thank you to my husband for that idea. This is the brick one. I have this pretty orange flurry flurry <laughs> I don't know floral kind of orange thing in the corner rub on uh, these burlap flowers and the letter B and I put a circle behind it so you can see the B a little bit better this is the one I'm worried about I made so many goofs on this one and in trying to cover them up I think I made more goofs Danielle says I'm in too much in my head yes yeah. you are but I don't know. I still think it looks like a kindergartner did it. And I just don't think it's good. I need you guys' opinion. I value Danielle's opinion. But she is my peanut. So she's likely to tell me my stuff looks good. Whether it does or not. It looks fine. <laughs> Ooh, I shook the thing. Alright, here we go. I had put this black uh, bird rub-on on here. But when I did, some other rub-ons from the page, because I clearly didn't think about how to do this, got on the page. So I put some butterflies on to kind of cover them. And up in this corner, um, a flower went up here, but it tore up as well. And so I put this metal embellishment on here. Well, I just knew I was going to end up using one of those somewhere. Well, and she got three flowers on hers, burlap flowers and letter C. Now, I have one notebook held back that I was going to make for me, and I don't know. I may end up just redoing this one entirely, but maybe Danielle's right. Maybe I'm all in my head. So, let me see. What did we do today, Danielle? Danielle worked all day. She started work at 10.15 this morning and just got home. 10.45. Or 10.45. And just got home. She's a busy, busy bee. And I really didn't do much of anything today except for finish up these projects and wait for Danielle to get home. But now that this is done, we are going to move on to another awesome project. Give me a day to maybe uh, film something goofy tomorrow and <laughs> so I can have a little break of working on stuff. And then I'll get on my awesome project that I'm just going to throw all my mixed media things at it. I want to get my hands dirty. I love to watch people use Mod Podge, but I see so many people get brushes out to use their Mod Podge, and I'm such a dork. I just open it up. Well, I open it up and just stick my fingers in it and go. Anytime anybody asks me what my favorite project to work on, I say it's anyone where I can get my hands dirty. I like to use texture paste. This is awesome. This is texture paste with sand in it. It's so cool. I've got some new things since the last time I used them. I cannot wait to get started. I'm going to pull that cinch out. Oh, we're going to have so much fun. But in the meantime, these are the notebooks that I love. They'll go out. This is the one. Tell me what you think. Well, I'll see you all in a video tomorrow. Thank you so much, everybody. You're the best. Bye. Bye. Oh, before we go, Gareth, I'm sorry you didn't get your daily fix while you were still awake. Love you. Bye.